finally. I think I've been waiting for this moment for a long, long time, as much as Anna has been waiting. But All of this camaraderie, I think the entire experience of getting ready together and then seeing our best friend uh, doll up as a bride, I think it's it's just picture perfect. So I think they were the most easygoing couple. They just went with the flow. Both of them are super relaxed and they're so chill. And I love how they both complement each other. Like, you know, if uh, Calvin is not relaxed, Naki will bring him down. If Naki is not relaxed, Calvin will bring her down. So it's like that. But they I, I just love how they are. And I love their first dance. I was super excited about their first dance. So usually when couples get together, they become like one unit. Calvin and Nakita are still one unit, but they make sure and they nurture each other to a point where they enhance each other's personalities. You know, like I think Nakita makes Calvin more Calvin and what I like about him and vice versa. Yeah, yeah, like all of us have been waiting for this day for, very, for quite some time now. Like every time she comes home, like it's always she always has this positive vibes, and we're always like very, everyone's happy, and it's always like and she's always very fun, very nice. My goodness, and how much she inspires us all every single day of her existence. Just you existing and being you is everything. Like there's so much inspiration from just you, the way you do life, the way you do every single moment. I love you so much, Naku. Oh my god, I didn't realize I'm gonna get emo. But yeah, now you mean the world to me. <laughs> she's my main, she's my constant. She's my life jacket, so yeah, she's not going anywhere. <laughs> I'm just really overwhelmed because this is yet another phase that we're going through together. And yeah, fluidity. <laughs> I love you. Please keep continuing to age like fine wine because that is... You're killing it, sorry. This is so emo. We need to do another shot. Uh. <laughs> so, uh, we do it as a profession, okay? Yeah. But the stress levels are much more because this is my sister, yeah. you know? There's family involved. People expect it to be a, a grand yeah, and a great they event. Yeah, they expect it to be like, you know, the way we, we would do like a regular wedding. So, but it's much more than that because it's like our sister's wedding. We so, had to make it special. You saw her now. Hi, Nancy. Five hour wedding dress. <laughs> In fact, uh, we are classmates, you know. Okay. Her, her mother in law and I. So, we pet them up. And for like 30 years, they never met each other, most never spoke. And then they reconnected over a WhatsApp chat. So they started meeting each other. And uh, I was yeah, busy with my own work because I was starting my business. Not right now. But then, convincing, convincing, there was a third friend who said, why don't they just try? So I said, okay, what I'll do? A copy, what I'll do? So I met her at her brother's place and I took her out. He picked me up and uh, he said, okay, we are going out for coffee. There are three places I would recommend. Mm -hmm. And each place he told me what it gives you. Like, you know, what kind of coffee, the ambience, the vibe, all of it. And he gave me to choose. So I think the fact that my choice mattered and it continues to be the same, you know. And I think that was something that always stayed with me. Uh, you know, that I always had a choice uh, and I was, you know, that I really appreciated that part of it. We organized the arrangement mm -hmm. and uh, they chose the cafe yeah, with them. Okay. And it clicked at first sight. Now four years that we know each other. Four four years, four and a half years that we know each other. That's a good journey. I met her in the hostel. We weren't in the same class and we just hit it off as, as if we were always meant to be. And then the, there's no looking back. The friendship's just grown leaps and bounds after that. <laughs> Every time I think about Naki, is just pure. She's pure emotions and I love her for that. Thank you. I think for more than half my age, that has been the case. Like, he's the first person that I would call when I'm in trouble. I think most of my emotional highs and lows have, have been shared with him. Actually, uh... 
it's in a good way and a bad way so so it's a little bit in a bad way my father fell ill but and i did not know how to handle it emotionally but she was there and it's easy for someone to say you know i'm in a bad situation i'm going to go or not be by my side but she stood by me and that's where i really found out who she is because it's easy to you know back off and say okay but she stand, stood by me she said whatever has to be done let it be done if we have to delay our first marriage delay so i knew she was always there to support me and stand by my side so that i always appreciate it her my papa and mama has been a, a rock for me a stable rock and they have been through you know who i am and all my goals whatever i have accomplished is because of them both of them thank you so much mama and papa my elder brother had to you know at the age of 19 he had to take the tag of of being the father symbol in our lives and he took it uh, effortlessly even today you know i'm sitting here having these conversations because he's kind of manning everything in the background nakita take this ring as a sign of my love and fidelity in the name of the father and of the son and of the holy spirit cousin take this ring as a sign of my love and fidelity in the name of the father and of the son and of the holy spirit what gives me hope is how nakita and calvin actually managed to nurture support and you know maintain that individuality that makes calvin calvin and nakita nakita like they are one unit but that has exciting aspects of both their personalities and that's something that i really love about them and that's something that i find really inspiration so without further ado i'd like to propose a toast to this wonderful evening and two of the most incredible people that i know nakita and calvin congratulations i love you both cheers my father and oh my mother oh my sister and oh my brother oh my sister. i always consider nakita as a cheese between the two slices right so basically me is the one slice and my brother is the other slice and she is the girl in between that thing that cheese you know has to be satisfied you know like when you eat a bite someone should be happy you know that that sandwich is really really good so this event for us was something like that right we had to make the sandwich really really good for for everyone today and tonight is your night i want you to just enjoy yourself you are the focus Everyone is looking at us. Whatever happens, that happens. Let's just go for that. Still, voice in my head that leads me to sin. Lord, lay my 